Hello, my name is Kent Hayes. I'm the Senior Product Manager for Speed Solutions at Custom Signals. This is the Falcon HR directional K-band radar from Custom Signals. The Falcon HR features a high-performance, low-power K-band radar antenna that uh, consumes much less power than the competitive units. For example, with the battery handle that I have installed here, you can get over 25 to 30 hours of operation, which is three to four times longer than the closest competitor. I have complete control of the radar from the, the buttons on this panel. For example, if I want to change the mode of operation from stationary all, I can, I can change it to approaching only, which is indicated by the road graphic here. I can look at receding only, or I can change it back to stationary all operation. Now, if this radar were enabled for moving operations, it has a sensor in the cradle that when I placed it into the mount in the car, it would detect that it was in the mount and it would enable moving operations. I can also adjust the audio control. For example, if I wanted to change the audio volume, I can change it up or down for the Doppler audio. Likewise, for the range sensitivity, I can change the range sensitivity up or down with the range button. I can power on and off the device with the power button. And there's a couple of dual function buttons. For example, if I wanted to turn on the backlight, I hit the test button and the mode button. If I want to turn off the backlight, I do the same operations. And then if I want to squelch or unsquelch the audio Doppler, I do hit the mode button and then the audio button to unsquelch the audio. One of the nice features about the, the Falcon HR is I can, tr I can track strongest or fastest targets, and I can mock either strongest or fastest targets. For example, right now I'm tracking two targets. If I want to lock in the 59, I can lock it in there and I can continue tracking that particular target. Now with the track through lock feature, the radar will continue to transmit for another five seconds after I've released the trigger. Now if I only want to track strongest targets, I can toggle off the fastest feature by double clicking the radar button. And now I can track only strongest targets. For example, if I want to lock in that 45, 46, now I can release the trigger and lock him in. And again, the track through lock feature will continue to transmit for another five seconds, allowing supporting my tracking history. And that's the Falcon HR from Custom Signals.